How does a pastry go viral? Well, if you're the inventor of the cronut, it starts with a whole lot of butter. The rest has been secret until now. ABC's Sarah Haynes got a hands-on demonstration and the enviable job of trying out the results. It's no surprise people go nuts for cronuts. The $5 croissanti donut confection that's gone viral. People lining up as early as 5 a.m., even overnight sometimes, just to snag a maximum of two of these elite treats. All right. But what if we told you you didn't have to stand on that crazy long line? Now in his new book, The Secret Recipes, cronut creator Dominique Ansel is revealing his special at-home recipe for all you dough-loving disciples. What do you hope people get from this cookbook? I hope that people get inspired when they have the cookbook in their hands. It's not about just following a recipe, but sometimes, you know, you take a recipe that you have from your mom, from your grandma, and you turn it into yours. It's not the exact same recipe, but now people can make the at-home cronut. I wanted to make sure that everyone could do it at home with the ingredients you could find in a grocery shop. And yet this recipe is no cakewalk. The at-home version takes three days to create. Day one is all about making the dough. Sugar. Sure, I recognize that one. She's my soul sister. <laughs> <laughs> Fast forward to day two, where we roll out, <laughs> then laminate the dough, a process where butter is folded in. Dough, butter, dough, dough, mm -hmm. butter, dough. And finally on day three, it's time to cut the dough. And after letting the dough rest for two hours in a warm Ta -da. setting, <gasps> we're ready to fry. This is a drop the spatula moment. Then fill, sugar, and glaze. For Nightline, I'm Sarah Haynes in New York. I did a really good job. Good job, sir. <laughs>